Yo guys, welcome back to my channel. This is part 6 of the Discord.js guide and in this episode, I'm going to be teaching you how you can create a random number generator. So, let's just jump straight into it. I hope you'll enjoy. So, now I'm going to be creating a command. Let's call it rand. And this command is going to be generating the random number. So, let's type in bot.commands.get rand dot execute and I'm going to be typing in message args and also discord because I'm going to be displaying the random value inside and inside an embed so that's why and now let's create the file rand.js and there we go so now let's create this file module.exports I mean let's fill it in equals to name rand comma description which will be it generates a random number another comma and then let's execute it there we go so now that is done and I just have to put in the code so let me show you how you can generate a random number so you just do let let's call this value rand number equal to math dot round brackets math dot random another set of brackets go to the right and type in your value so this generates a random number between 10 and 1 so basically how this works is math dot random generates the number and the number however will be in decimal so to round it off you use math dot round you can also use math dot floor or math dot seal doesn't really matter so that's the value here but this is not how i'm going to be generating the number because i'm going to be letting the user type in the minimum and maximum values so let's do that so first off let me create an if statement if exclamation mark args length so basically this means if the argument is not given or if exclamation mark args one so basically if either both of the arguments are not there or only the second one is not there this will be executed let's type in message dot channel dot send and i'm going to be sending this So yeah, as you can see, this is how I did it and the backticks here actually create a new string inside this. So that might cause some errors. I mean, that will cause some errors. So all you have to do is use the backward slash and that fixes it and it only gets formatted. So yeah, now let me create the else statement when both the arguments are there and let max equals to arg zero. So the first argument and let min equal to args1 so here I'm going to be making this max plus min so the maximum value will be max which is the first value and minimum value will be min and after that the value has been created here and now I'm going to be creating an embed which displays it so let's do const embed equals to new discord.message embed and let's set the title the title will be there we go that's the title and let our description be the value so it is gonna be random number and let's also add some color footer and all that so the color will be yellow because why not and footer will be random number generator and let's end off with the uh, with the timestamp you don't have to type in anything because the timestamp is automatically generated so there we go we have created the embed right here and now time to send it let me do message or reply this time so that it mentions you and type in embed so there we go we have created the command let's test it out I'm going to be typing in rand yeah so it tells me that I have to enter the value so let's type in 10 and 5 and your random number is 6 let me try a bigger number this time there we go we got 344 so the command works that's for sure 
and yeah i think i'm gonna be wrapping up the video right here this was a tutorial for the random number generator thanks for watching this video guys please leave a like if you enjoyed it and make sure to subscribe see you in the next one peace